Hey, what's going on? Jerome here, and I have you guys some awesome new Minecraft gameplay. This is for our Dungeon Runner series, and needless to say, I'm a little bit angry. And uh, the reason for that is I filmed for about 10 minutes earlier, and my uh, recording software decided to be like, nope, nope, hashtag nope, and uh, I just deleted the uh, file pretty much. Well, it didn't delete the file. What it ended up doing was keeping the audio and erasing the video. Don't ask me why it did that. I don't have the slightest clue. But I can tell you one thing. It actually got me pretty angry, so I'm a little bit disappointed. But uh, hey, sometimes things like that happen and there's nothing you can really do about it except try and fight through it and uh hopefully the next recording doesn't end up that way at least i'm hoping this one doesn't oh that one was so good so close but don't worry guys in that recording you really didn't miss much in fact i wasn't even able to defeat that one simple jump that we just got stopped at right there the entire time was pretty much me just raging trying to beat that so you didn't miss anything too good but i guess if you're into me raging then maybe you did miss a little bit of something but uh regardless let's get this thing going now, so, basically, I've been kind of- Oh my god! Holy bejesus! Ho, 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 ho! Look at that! Look at that, look at that! I did it! Oh my god. I can't- I- I- I can't believe I actually just did that. Like, you don't even understand. Oh my god, this makes me so happy. Alright, well, I'm gonna get back to what I was saying, though. But, uh, yeah, so anyway, guys, I've been really excited lately because, uh, what is it? Not only is Borderlands 2 coming out, but also- Oh my god, I swear to god. I swear to God, if that's how I have to die. I don't think so, though, because I think I have it on peaceful or easy mode or something, so I don't think I'm going to die from that. But um, I'm just going to wait for the fire to go out. But basically, I've been being able to lately film about my average three to five videos every single day. So I have five videos every day on the weekends and three videos to four videos about every single weekday. So I'm glad I finally found my groove once I got to college. It took me about a week and a half, but I finally got into it, and uh, now I can kind of do that on whim pretty much. I can, it's pretty easy to do, not that bad at all. I used to think it was a challenge here, but it's really not, actually. It's... It's pretty easy once you get it down. Oh, okay, that was lucky right there when we just fell, but uh, I kind of knew that. that's why I aimed the jump there. In case we were to miss it, we just land on the platform and restart it. So that's why I aimed it the way I did, and I wasn't really that worried when I was falling. But uh, yeah, so GG. All right, we're at that jump again. But uh, what is it? One thing that I'm doing as of now, I'm trying to get done at least, is to play Borderlands 2 on my Mac, I have to download a cross-platformer. And if you don't know what that is, it basically allows me to run Windows on my Mac and vice versa. So I can kind of go between the two uh, different operating systems at whim, and I can just do whatever I want, basically. And uh, it'll work out well, but the problem is it's very hard to get, and uh, I'm currently downloading Windows 8 right now for my Mac, the uh, Windows 8 Preview. I know Windows 8 Official isn't out yet. Wow, we just kept missing that same jump there. But Windows 8 Preview is out, though. If you don't know what that is, it's basically Windows 8, except it, you know, has some bugs, things like that, that Windows 8 has to fix. But from what I hear, most Steam games work for it. There are some that don't, so I'm hoping that Borderlands 2 is not one of those that won't work. But, uh... By the looks of it, though, I haven't seen anyone complaining about it yet, so I'm pretty sure it might work out. No! No! Por qué? We were doing so well that it really disappoints me, because you don't understand, I've never beaten that one area, the third jump. So, like, that's the first... This is the second. I literally, in the other part of this, uh, the third was over in that section. But uh, in the other part of this, I I literally spent 10 minutes, the one that, like, the lost footage, trying to beat it. Couldn't do it. And the previous part that I actually put online, I did it for 10 minutes. Couldn't do it. So basically 20 minutes of time went into trying to do one jump. And I finally hit it there, and I just lost it in a pathetic way. So I was really saddened by that. But let's see, maybe I can get a better jump. Nah, we're back to our old ways, I guess. I was so amazed when I nailed that. But anyway, back on to other topics about the cross-platformer. Yeah, it should work well. I'm kind of hoping so. I'm using a program called Parallel Wizard or something like that, and uh, I don't know. I'm hoping that it'll work out. Let's let's hope so, too. That way I can get some Borderlands 2 footage. If it does, I'm going to be filming Borderlands 2 with the ASF crew tonight, and then I'm also going to be doing a so... Oh my god, that was badass. All right, I'm starting to get the hang of this now. I'm getting into the zone. That's what It may take 20 minutes for me to beat a part, but when I beat it, I beat it hard. Oh god, that was... Pretend you didn't hear me say that. In fact, please, please don't quote me on that. Please, no one, no one, no one put that out of context. That's gonna happen, especially now that I begged you guys not to. That's gonna happen. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna do Borderlands 2 with all the guys, and then after that, I'm probably gonna do some Borderlands 2 solo let's play, just because I love Borderlands 2, and I don't really want to have to wait for them whenever I want to film. Because let's be honest, it'll probably only be like once every two to three days we'll film it. We'll probably do like an hour to two hour recording each day, but still, it'll be annoying to have to have that big gap in between recording sessions where I don't get to play, and it'll make me sad in the pants. 
If you're wondering, I don't really know which character I want to use, just because, I don't know, there's all new characters now, and I kind of want to get a feel for everyone. I'm glad, I, I used to be the hunter, and while I'm sad that he's not back in the game, I'm kind of glad, because then I'm not tempted to use him, and now I'll get a little bit of a different experience in the whole Borderlands community and everything like that, so it'll be pretty fun. I'm kind of glad about that. So, I don't know who I'm going to use yet. Zach actually texted asking me. I have not the slightest clue. I don't even know who all the new characters are. But I will say one thing, that uh, I, I will take whatever character that they do not want. So what I basically told them was, whatever character you guys don't want, or you just say, like, nope, he's bad, I'll take him. I don't really care. I just want to have a different experience than I had before. Although, preferably, I don't want to be the soldier class. I don't really like being support. I know that th that's the only class I know that's returned, is the soldier. And I think the phase shifter returned as well, but I don't know about the other two. I know, I know that the hunter didn't. I don't know who he was replaced by. And I hear that there might be five units now, so I'm not really quite sure, but whatever the case may be, I, I don't know. I'll take whoever can come my way. And what, what the heck? Did anyone else just, anyone else just see that? It's kind of like, I feel like a sticky piston just tried to smash me or something. That was really random. Oh, well, I guess that just kind of happens at random points in time. That was creepy, though. All right, let's jump through here now. Here we go. The big jump. Oh, my God. What? I hit my head on there, of course. Ah, oh, so that makes it so that you can't cut the corners, really. That's a little disappointing. I don't know why they didn't raise the ceiling there so that that stuff didn't happen. If you guys are wondering, my last part, I already said that if by the end of this, I don't show any kind of, like, marketable, like, improvement, like, basically, like, oh, yeah, I'm doing very good, then uh, I'm probably just going to cheat my way through that next part where, basically, I'm going to build a bridge across it. That way I can just beat it because otherwise it gets a little redundant watching me play, like, 40, 50 minutes into a Let's Play of me just trying to make a single jump. I don't think you guys want to see that, so I'm probably just going to cheat my way across it in the end. Yeah, especially when I do big whiffs like that. I don't know. I'm still very sad. I finally beat it for the first time ever, and then all of a sudden I just get crushed. They're like, no, please. Oh, uh, well. I just had a nice lunch, by the way. My college offers some good lunch food. I got it. I, mean, I, I was pretty surprised. And it's all you can eat, too, so I'm really happy about that. But yeah, I don't know. I was pretty surprised about that. It, it is good. If you're wondering, though, I don't really eat that much. I wish I could take advantage of that more, but I am very skinny, I guess you could say. I don't really eat much. I'm like... You know, I, I'm very, very underweight, so for me, I don't really get to take advantage of that, which is a little sad-faced. But I do get some good foods in there sometimes. Like, today, I kind of pigged out a little bit, I'll admit it. But, uh, I don't know. It's nice just to have that comfort there. They also have takeout food, but the takeout food tends to be a little bit on the sketch side. You know, you got, like, burrito takeout, and that's, uh... Needless to say, takeout burritos always kind of sound a little sketchy, let's be honest here. But they did make pizzas one time, which is really cool. And I'm talking about, like, it was smaller than, like, a large pie, but it was a whole pie, like, maybe, like, bigger than a pan pizza, smaller than a large... Oh my god, I just got denied by one block. Somewhere in between those sizes, though, and, uh, all for one person. Like, you just got it if you swiped in, and you're like, wow, okay, I'll take that. So it was really cool, I was kind of happy about that, but yeah. Okay, I'm going to try and get my head in the game now, because we're running out of time for this, and uh, I kind of get keep getting so close that it's it's getting me a little antsy. Oh, man, that one, I had the turn right and everything. I would have been able to... The problem is, when you make the jump, you have to try and keep your sprint while doing it. Like, right there, that was good practice. If you notice what I was doing was trying to make a 90-degree turn while keeping my sprint going. So maybe I'll try and practice it here as well. There we go, yeah. So I need to do something along those lines without losing my sprint. It gets a little difficult sometimes, but it is definitely by far possible. Let's see, come on. Oh, that's a problem. See right there? I lost the sprint. So every once in a while, you'll lose that sprint, and then there's no way you can make the next jump. And it's just a little bit disappointing whenever that happens. But there must be something else going on behind the scenes. Like, maybe I'm hitting, hitting my head on the roof because, I don't know, it just seems like this is a little bit more difficult than it should be. Or at least than it seems like it would be. Okay, here we go. Oh, I think, honestly, one thing, I wish that the creator of this map set the uh, redstone current to a little bit of a different timer so that it added on maybe 33% more time to that jump. Because I think this one jump really does waste a lot of time for people. Like, I feel like if you're going to waste all your time on one jump, you know, it's, it gets a little bit boring. I'm just surprised he wouldn't, you know, try and speed it up a bit and uh, raise the timer. Oh, that time was a perfect run, but I missed the corner. I just barely missed the clip of it by, uh... By a tiny bit, so I guess that that was no one else's fault but mine, but still a little disappointing, you know, sometimes you get really close and then, uh, you get shut down like that, it's just kind of very sad in the face. Alright, let's go for this jump now. Come on. Oh, GG, look at that! We almost barely missed that because, uh, actually, surprisingly, because the block stayed out for too long, we almost missed it because the blocks were there for so long. But, uh, afterward it retracted and luckily I was able to hang on to the edge, which was... A little shocking for me. I, I would have been so mad if 
the fact that the block stayed there too long, which is the reason I lost. Okay, we're back to right over here now. Oh, second furthest we ever made it, right there. We're, we keep, we're tied now. We are tied, this is the second furthest we ever made it. And I can't believe I made it both in this video. So maybe I won't cheat next video. I'll have to gauge it by the, because I did pretty well this one, I'll gauge it by the next one. If I struggle too much, then I'm probably gonna cheat for it in the next, next part. But as for now, I'm pretty decided that I'm not going to cheat, at least for the next part. Oh my god, I accidentally just walked off that cliff. That would have been really sad. My finger slipped and hit the W key, and I actually, uh, as soon as I saw myself walking forward, I'm like, no! Alright, here we go, here we go. Come on, come on. There we go. Holy crap. Just barely. Wow, okay, now things are getting a little crazy, and there's no ivy to hook onto the walls, too. There is nothing here to support you. This is all on you, basically. Oh my god. Oh wow, I know where we are. We just jumped from there, that's our start. Oh my god, I almost just missed the sprint. That's what I hate, Minecraft sprint key is pretty broken. Alright, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I guess I'm supposed to... Wait, is there something to the right though? I mean, jumping straight over there, it's not going to do anything. I'm just going to end up dying, right? Although there may... Is there something around that edge there? Let me see. No, that's just that, so then... No, you know what? You probably do have to go to the right then. I'm just guessing at least. Unless maybe you go through the lava over there and then you get cooled off in the water. Alright, let's see. Let's see what happens. We gotta go at some point in time. My god. That wasn't what you... So it was a trap then. Alright, GG. I just got played. I'm done for the day. So thank you all for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And at least we got a little bit further on that. It definitely shows some promising results. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you all enjoyed and have a good night.